Hey everybody, in this video we're going to be taking a look at what comes with the PLTW box kit um, that we can get in the uh, My PLTW store. Alright, so uh, first thing is, is that if we take a look at actual uh, the problem 8.2 Atomic Design Challenge, when we come down and start taking a look at the equipment and resources we are going to need for this, we're going to be seeing here that we do need the box created all the way back in uh, Project 3.9, Manufacturing a Box. All right, and when we go back and take a look at that within the curriculum, uh, you're going to be seeing, if I can get to it, there we go, um, is that we need to go out here and create a, uh, a box. Um, and uh, what's kind of nice is, is that PLTW knows we need to create this box, and they are giving us the opportunity to actually cre uh, create the box from a kit that we can, uh, we can purchase from the uh, PLTW store. So when we take a look at my PLTW and we go into our store, All right, we can go ahead and get started purchasing equipment. And I can see I have my site chosen, which is my home, Lockport Township High School, and I can build that list. It's going to be asking you what, uh, you know, what strain of courses we are currently in. So obviously we're an IED, uh, so that's found within the PLTW engineering strand. And we come down here and just select on IED. Okay, with the, uh, the store, we can uh, indicate whether this is a new or an existing course. Uh, we can tell how many uh, total students we have, uh, and then we can choose whether or not we want full sets per classroom or shared sets per classroom. And, and just in this case, I'm going to say, hey, this is a brand new course. I have 20 students, and I would like the, there to be full sets per classroom. I'm going to go ahead, down here and go ahead and customize the list. So when we do that, we're going to see all the recommendations that PLTW uh, has for us for... Uh, uh, purchasing things for our classrooms and I'm gonna go ahead and just move on down here and I'm gonna be finding our PLTW box kit and if I can find it I'd be more than happy to show it to you and where'd it go there it is okay so when we take a look at this okay here is what you're going to be seeing all right, so everything that you are seeing here as of right now, uh, we're talking about January 2019. Uh, we can see for a class of 20, we are going to need one uh, student pack, which is going to come with 20 of these of the Automata box kit. Uh, since there are 20 of them, uh, we're going to be looking at a price of $140, so we're seeing these are about $7 uh, per pack. All right. Most people, when we are talking about this at CTI or online core training, are asking, hey, do we have to purchase the kits? And the answer is no. All right. There's actually a lot of people who have used um, other variations of this. They've created their own. Uh, it's however you want to handle it. I'm just letting you see that this option is available to you. So about $7 per kit. Okay. And now we're going to go ahead and take a look at what this kit is actually going to look like. So I'm going to use my document camera and jump over here and take a look at this. All right. And I have gone out there and taken the kit, uh, which is going to be coming in this uh, plastic sleeve. All right, and what you're going to see inside of it is you're going to be seeing five pieces of MDF. Okay, on the back side of this, you're going to be seeing a corrugated plastic. There are two square dowels, and it's also going to be coming with two smaller, uh, thinner round dowels. Okay, so when we go ahead and cut this open and take a look at it, okay, you're going to be seeing that these are MDF, medium density fiberboard. Okay, I know those parts are going to be uh, very, very closely cut to the specifications that you need. They do a pretty good job with that. And then we're going to be seeing that we have these small round dowels. I don't know if you can see that or not. Okay, but it's a little bit thinner. Okay, and it is round. Okay, there is a little flex to them. Okay, and we also are uh, going to be seeing that we also have these uh, quarter inch uh, square dowels. All right. And then finally on the back that sort of uh, gives all this kit its shape is we're going to be coming, um, or they're going to be sending us this corrugated plastic. All right, so just your typical sort of plastic use on uh, political signs, uh, garage sale signs. Um, so there you go. All right, so that is what is going to be coming with the PLTW box kit. Like I said, pretty good quality stuff. Uh, cut to, uh, to specifications it needs to be uh, for doing 3.9. All right. All right, so now that we have taken a look at that, I do uh, want to jump out here. All right, and I actually want to take a look Okay, at the sizes that come with everything within the kit. All right, so this is just a working or set of working drawings I've thrown together. Okay, we kind of get the idea of what uh, we're trying to create and what comes with it. All right, and then this is the actual assembly. This is how everything sort of fits together. So you get a full assembly multi-view of that. 
Okay, and then we're seeing our exploded assembly with our parts list. Okay, so we're going to be seeing that uh, we have duplicates uh, for top and bottom, and those uh, those parts are going to be five by four. The thickness of the MDF is going to be a quarter of an inch. We're going to be seeing we have duplicates, so we're going to be also getting two of uh, the side parts, uh, and those are going to measure four by four, and they have a thickness of a quarter of an inch. And then finally, our last part, this is going to be coming with uh, for the box itself, uh, is going to be our back piece, which is four and a half by four, and it has a thickness of a quarter of an inch. Okay, the corrugated uh, plastic sheet that they're going to be sending us uh, is 12 by 12. It has a, a thickness of roughly about an eighth of an inch, so 0.125. Okay, and the chambers themselves are, are like an eighth of an inch. All right, so it uh, kind of gives you a little idea of what that looks like from the side within that detail view that you see here. Okay, the round dowel that this comes with is going to be a diameter of 0.115. Okay, and we can see that this is a, um, they're going to be cut to a length of about 12 inches, about one foot. And the last thing that this kit is going to be coming with is a square dowel. It's a quarter of an inch by quarter of an inch, and uh, those are cut to a length of 12 inches. All right, so just a basic overview of what the PLTW box kit is, uh, where you can get that, the pricing of it, uh, and then all the parts that are, are coming with it. So we're looking at five pieces of MDF, the 12 by 12 sheet of corrugated plastic. Uh, we have two uh, quarter inch uh, by 12 inch um, square dowels, and then we have the 0.115 uh, round dowels, and those uh, we have two of those, and those are a length of 12 inches.